This is Dr. Harry Anderson. I know a lot of you out there are always asking questions about how should I worm my horses? How often? With what product? Etc. Coming at it from a nutritional aspect, rather than a medical aspect, I firmly believe that worming is, and I should, probably shouldn't say worming in itself, but controlling parasite invasion in a horse is very, very critical to the overall health, the use of nutrients, the digestibility of feed. All those things are affected by internal parasites, which all horses carry. They're going to have parasites, so how do we deal with it? Well, I like to think in terms of prevention to start with. If you have a healthy gut, if you have a good, well-balanced nutritional program, you're probably going to have less parasite loads and a reduced uh, need for heavy worming real often. But that's simply going to be a judgment call uh, based on your uh, horse's health, attitude, the way they look, the way they're using their nutrients and things, and, and then you have to decide how often what. How you decide is that you work with your local veterinarian and let them tell you what's working in your area and what they recommend for different seasons and for different environments and actually uh, for different feeding programs. If you're just feeding low quality roughage out there and the horse is, is kind of roughing it along, you're probably gonna have more problems than if you're feeding a good, well-balanced program that has a good, healthy gut and you have no stress, because stress also plays a part in the parasite load. If you stress an animal, then the immune system is not as good, they, the gut environment probably won't be as good because of their nervousness, and you're going to have to be more concerned about it. But do work with your local veterinarian, follow their advice, and you'll have a healthy horse.